Good morning, AJ. It's Tuesday, February 24th, and I'm really tired. I just woke up from my latest nap, which brings my total napping hours today to almost five and a half hours. I love sleep. I eagerly await my punishment for tomorrow, but in the meantime, I have something to say to you, too. Combo Breaker! Do you remember when you lost the Contra vs PC GAMING WAR? You still haven't been challenged for that. AJ, if it is at all within your means, I think you to do a vlog with at least one conspicuous item of female clothing. I was told that you need to do it all completely, like, just as a girl, but this is a challenge, not a punishment, so I feel that we should let up on that. Oh, and just for the record, consoles for the win! By the way, AJ, about the push-up challenge, ever since we started the challenge, every time I do the push-ups, I get this kind of big pressure behind my eyes and it's always hurt really badly. Yesterday, when I went to the optometrist, I learned that I have very high intraocular pressure, which can eventually lead to glaucoma and eventually blindness. But I'm gonna try and take it slow on the push-up challenge until I can talk to my optometrist next month and find out if it's okay. On the upside, week five has been really easy so far, so I'm ready for week six. 100 push-ups, here I come! To answer your question slash statement, I did actually tell you at one point that Ryan Stiles lived in Bellingham, but I had no idea about the club. I think that if you were to perform for the Gopher Green Challenge and you were to meet him, that would be so cool. He is still my favorite performer on Whose Sign Is It Anyway. Now, I know that you're not big on acting, but I think that you should try and like be part of the club. If it's open to the public and to students, I implore you as part of the project to go at least once. Or is it not open to students? Thank you, by the way, for showing off all of your green tips. Green. Green. That word has an R in it. Sounded like I said geen. Green hat. AJ, I've always thought that I'm at least pretty decent at being an environmentalist. I'm going to go through all six of your points and you tell me how green I really am. One, recycling. AJ, you know how prolific my family is at recycling. I think we're pretty good at it. We recycle just about everything that we can and I get very angry at people who do not recycle. In fact, that's one of my biggest pet peeves is when people throw away soda cans or newspapers into the trash can. Luckily though, my school has about one recycle bin per trash can. If you're wondering what that was, it's a balloon guitar that my mom has. Two shopping bags! It depends on where we go shopping. We usually go to either Safeway or we go to the commissary on base. The commissary on base gives us paper bags which we usually recycle. At Safeway on the other hand we're usually given plastic bags. As you know we use that plastic bags on the litter box but then we throw them away so they are indeed very wasteful. Just because we use them to clean up poop doesn't mean they can't still be recycled. We still do try and recycle them a lot though, but sometimes it just doesn't work out that way. Three, transportation. Even though I have my license now, I still take the bus. If I'm not taking the bus, I carpool. But the problem is, um, I don't have a job yet, still. And without a job, I can't pay for gas. And my car is just about out of gas. So I can't drive until I get a job meaning that I'm still forced to ride the bus or carpool. Accidental green for the win! However, I do still have a little bit of a beef with the bus because Kitsap County Transportation really kind of sucks and they're actually raising the price for it, like doubling it. So we, I might have to find another alternative pretty soon. Carpooling seems like a pretty good idea to me. Four, lights. This is probably my worst thing. I... I like to have lights on. I like to have a lot of lights on in the house. Even when it's dark out, even when I don't need them, when there's no one in the house, I get really almost depressed when it's too dark inside the house. I really like long showers. I really like the relaxation time that you find in the shower. And so I tend to, if I can, take like 20 minute showers. I think I'm out of time, so I'm gonna go really quick. Appliances, I'm really good about that too. Overall, I think I'm pretty green. As for Firefly, my friend Carl has it on Blu-ray and a very good TV and very good surround sound. He's invited both of us over to his house for the marathon. AJ, I'll see you tomorrow. Preferably in a dress. 